hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a hair video watch me transform this 613 wig into a beautiful pink color um bear with me y'all my voice is kind of gone but yeah i know i still gotta get out this content so today i'm doing the water method i'm going to go in with the two pinks i'm going to do the atomic pink and the cotton candy so i fill my bucket up with hot water and then I start basically doing an even coat of each color in the water. And then I just start mixing it real good together. So, of course, I felt like I needed to add more, so I added more. And then we're going to start dipping the hair in and getting that pink look, child. Okay, so now what I like to do when it comes to me dipping the hair in the water, um, I like to spread the hair, like, separate in the middle and just go dodging in the water with it because a lot of the times the ends and the top of the hair is going to die quicker which is going to be more color on the hair and it's going to come out darker than actual the middle of the hair and in, in in between the hair so i just personally like to like open the hair up and dip that in first before doing the top and everywhere else because of course as y'all can see um I had to keep doing it over and over again. You see, I'm pouring more color in and I'm going to dip the hair once again. So I'll say this process, I dipped the hair, took it out, dipped the hair again, took it out a good like three, four times to get the color that I wanted. So far, you want to get with me, stop. Okay, so now I'm done with, you know, dipping the water. I'm just rinsing off the excess of the color. And then I'm gonna go in and um, shampoo and condition with Tresemme. Um, Y'all, that's my favorite product to use when it comes to like doing my wigs. Um, I'm not a fan of that silicone because it kind of leave like a texture on the hair that I don't like. It's like that product and it just feel, mm, it just don't give it what I need to give. So Tresemme is always my go-to. Okay, so once I was done shampooing and conditioning the hair, I began to blow dry it so I can get rid of that wave pattern. And then I'm gonna go in and start putting highlights so I can give the hair more of a pop, um, add different tones of pink because this is a birthday wig I'm working on and I just knew pink was gonna give on her. So yeah, I'm gonna go in with a pretty pink and y'all gonna see, y'all gonna see. Okay, so now I'm about to begin to work on the highlights and y'all like I'm so obsessed with doing this cat eye method when it comes to highlighting um it's basically me highlighting the top of the hair without trying to highlight the whole entire hair it saves a lot of more time and it still come out cute in the look that you want so right now I'm just sectioning off the hair into that cat eye look and once I do that I'm gonna go section by section start sectioning it off and add in the pink Okay, so I sectioned the hair off. I had to get the hair out of the way, child. So I'm going in with this Hawaiian fire. And now let's begin the highlights. So when it comes to coloring with just regular color and not bleach, I just slap it on there. Like, you don't have to use aluminum foil or saran wrap to keep the hair touching each other. As long as you're careful and not overly like making the highlighted hair touch other parts of the hair, you're good. Okay, so now I'm done with both sides and I'm going to be working in the middle section and I'm basically doing the same thing. Okay, 
Cause I'm hurting, cause I'm jaded. Most of these things I don't wanna say. I won't be around while you chase. You won't hear me up when you play. You'll try and come back when you're famous. I always wanna do what it's dangerous. You got something real, not base. Why is this so far away? You wanna get with me, stop. Okay, y'all, so I let the color sit on the hair for like a day, and I just shampooed, I shampooed it out, I didn't wash and condition it, because I already did that for the first round, and now I'm just going in to blow dry it, and y'all look how pretty it is, like, it's giving that pop of light pink, pop of dark pink, and it came out really cute, so now I'm going in to flat iron the hair, and just give it a bone straight look. Okay, so now I'm done flat ironing the hair and this is how it came out y'all is so pretty like it's giving me pink fantasy pink fairy tale and I love it I know she's gonna love it so I end up getting off camera styling the hair and this is the end result y'all I just love the look the color is just giving in oh if y'all need y'all wig hooked up baby call me and follow my Instagram page at J on the sleigh that's my hair business. If y'all ever need a wig made or created, I can transform it for y'all. But this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.